Well, I hope we're all enjoying the new world order that's uh, coming about in this year uh, 2014. What do I mean by that? There's a new entity that's come about um, called nanoparticles. It was first mapped out in 1995, and it's now it's in full swing. Uh, it's on the pharmaceutical, it's on the military, and it's on the scientific level. Now, scientific, scientists rather make this entity, which is a very tiny metallic machine. It's so tiny, it is just about the size of a, a cell, a human cell. And what happens is it enters the human body uh, by different ways. But let's, let's first say that it enters the, inter uh, enters the human body. It attaches itself to uh, a cell or, or somewhere in the brain. It could be a brain cell. It could be in the chest area. Or it can be in the, in the stomach or abdomen area. It attaches itself to whatever it's programmed to and stays there. It waits for its orders or... It's programmed to do a certain thing. If it's programmed to do a certain thing, it enters, it attaches to, say, uh, a cell, and it goes to work on a cell, either destroying the cell or interpolating a uh, disease within the human body. Subsequently, uh, from what I've read, a lot of the human populace are going to be coming down with a disease which you have open source and you ooze through those open source, and doctors are not going to be able to have a cure for it. Why? Because the CDC loves this nanoparticle. If you do further research beyond this video, you'll find out that the CDC is very much aware of the nanoparticles. They made to order. You can, if you're Your conglomerate, a giant, you can order this uh, nanoparticles. You could say, I want it to do this thing, this thing, or this thing. Say, for instance, I want it to attach to a human cell, or I want it. I want these nanoparticles uh, to attach to brains or uh, uh, intestines or what have you. And it goes to work and it takes its orders and it is either turned on by uh, drones that are flying in the area. So this is on the military level. So drones can come into a specific area, throw out the, the orders to these nanoparticles particles and they go to work. Now, the end result will be death. Uh, this is how the New World Order are going about things. They need to get rid of, for some strange reason, they need to get rid of over half of the population. They're not saying why. No one's saying why. No one's saying who these New World Order people are, the Bilderberg. So, uh, th that's the entity. It's a nanoparticle. It's extremely small and it's quite detrimental to the human body uh, you're going to be seeing in the near future in the in the very short future where people are coming down with diseases where they just started oozing material from the body it'll be an open sore and they won't be able to stop oozing uh, bodily fluids blood and they're going to die from it and the CDC will have no cure for it uh, subsequently, the AMA, uh, the American Medical Association, will also have no cure for it. And they'll just let hundreds of thousands of people uh, expire. It's quite sad. It's quite disturbing because this, this, is our, this is our future. I thought the 21st century was going to be flying, uh, flying cars and moving sidewalks and the like and teleportation. No, it's going to be death on a grand scale. So again, remember, it's on the pharmaceutical, it's on the military, it's on a scientific level. It's made by scientists. And um, as I progress in my knowledge of nanoparticles, I'll keep making these videos. But this is, uh, this is the beginning of something that's quite terrible. Thank you very much for your time.